we have a the template so what is the uh, here the thing is uh, notepad okay so what we can do so we can just first you have to take a copy of template and name it as one second so first loop each uh, excel from the folder okay so to loop each and every excel from the folder within the loop so you have to take a copy of the template with the file name that is a suresh name ramesh name right like that okay so it's like a as a ramesh dot dogx right dogx this is a template but this dot does not have a thing and read excel okay if the excel so the condition is like that if the excel does not have any data any data so what you can do so that does not have any data so you have to replace the name name is a file name right that is the first name and company uh, no company no so just put na na okay so status is na and experience is zero okay if it is a if it's a no company zero experience is zero and here also na okay na 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 everything but here is a zero experience zero years of experience okay that is a in that situation so got it so it does not have any data in that excel so zero experience zero years of experience and remaining is a na field na okay. next next uh, item so it, it has has data and no active status so there is a status column is there right if there is no active status then so what we have suppose there is that non-active status is the inactive active is there ramesh is uh, inactive inactive right so this is currently he is not working okay currently he is not working anywhere but his past experience is c so like this you have to replace this text with the table okay this table okay you know how to insert the table right you have to replace this text from this table okay he his experience actually his professional experience and uh, so number of uh, uh, years of experience number of years of experience in current job actually so this number of years of experience and status uh, is a uh, active so location everything is for the status is uh, active okay other than that so you should not take any record which is not active okay so just make that as a na 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 and number of years of experience is also any okay name anyway you will get from the so na for all okay except the name and you have to keep the table table in the uh, total experience table in tag okay that is the that situation so if you have a positive thing here you have a positive thing so let's take this one okay you have a positive thing so the suresh has a one active records so always it should have a one active record okay remaining things are inactive records okay you have to take the, that one active record and keep that uh, uh, company name here company name here and the location here okay and the experience the status is active you just make it active sorry in the second uh, this one so this has you have to put inactive inactive in status only inactive in status and total number of ex experience everything is a na so only in that all the records are inactive you have to full name uh, is a name of the file and status is a inactive the remaining things are na and the table also you have to display the inactive people okay so next the third one is a uh, if you have a data so you have to fill the company name status is active and the location is Bangalore. you have to convert this into the years suppose this by 12 you will get the years so but you have to specify uh, 2.9 only not 2.9.6667 uh, okay 2.9 years of experience this is a years of experience you have to calculate from the months of the year, months to the years Got it? that is a so template you have to convert so once you convert the template then the next thing is 
fill the active record to template okay so the next thing is so export to pdf okay export to pdf and uh, you have a lot of files right lot of files you have to send that uh, uh, summary okay summary data summary data like a so what is the name of the file and what is the experience number of experience okay okay name of the file name of the person is a name of the person basically name of the person is a like a suresh experience nine nine years of experience years of experience harish zero years of experience rajesh right so uh, three years of experience this is a number of number of number years experience years experience okay so this table you have to send as a on uh, uh, in the body of the mail okay in the body of the mail you have to send this uh, table can you do it this exercise ping, ping me in the chat window Have any difficulties just ask me now now itself do you all understand that uh, what you have to do right okay so so insert the table replace the text okay everything so let me let i will drop this one into the uh, yeah this is a this is a actually let's say see see this is a in the body you can specify the table html table right html table so first of all you have to summarize so always uh, you have to take a, a build data table uh, last time we discussed right yesterday or day before okay so we have to create a build data table that is a name and uh, experience year so while we are reading so we have to at the end we have to fill that data table as a name of the file and the experience in years once we convert this is a formula you to convert the experience in years and you have a, if, if you want to get that so you have a one thing is like a math dot you have a math dot round there is a math dot round suppose for example you are uh, uh, writing the sum so you have a suppose for example the double value okay uh, 2.91 R. so what is the experience so he is having the convert dot to double you just convert that number into the double the string value into the double here 34 right 35 okay just put 35 here and double okay this will convert into the double just uh, run you will get the double value okay so what happened so the, anyway it requires a string right dot to string So this will give the in the output panel double value with the uh, after two point something see uh, okay so 34 will not give the double value so what we have 34 divided by 12 so that is the 12 months right that that calculation it will give the double value so the calculation of the the month the number of months by this one so but we need only one uh, digit after the dot. So how can he here is a formula math dot round okay. we can round that math dot round after that so this is a expression comma how many number of digits after the point one digit is enough right so close that uh, not here remove this dot to string so because that should be a double not string value so in math dot round is a method it has a two parameters first parameter is a double value second parameter is a number of points see here now we got the 2.9 so like that you can get the 2.9 value that means the so single digits okay how many number of months so how many number of years so yeah mm, got it uh, 
uh, like that you have a pdf also so so pdf you have activities to interact with the pdf so a lot of activities to interact with the pdf read the pdf text suppose if you have any pdfs uh, uh, let's let me search Okay. The invoice type file type PDF download some invoices. So you can just uh, 